Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to create a recovery partition in Windows 10 or Windows 11 PC or laptop. It is a very easy and simple process. So let's go to our video. Here is the my disk management. Here we find C drive and there is no recovery partition and we has to create recovery partition for the our PC or laptop. It is a very IMP thing in the Windows 11 and Windows 10 or any on, the, on other Windows operating system. Close it. I first go to the start, right click on the start or go to the start and type disk management. And click on the create and format hard disk partition. Click on that. Disk management is open. Here we find there is no recovery partition. First go to the C drive, right click on the C drive or any other drive and here we find shrink volume, click on the shrink volume, wait for a few seconds, shrink volume is open. In a shrink volume, here we find enter the amount of space to shrink in MB. I want 1 GB, so I type 1024, it is an 1 GB, click on the shrink. Here we find unlocated space, 1 GB unlocated space, right click on it, click on new sample volume, click on that. Click on next. Here we find sample volume size MB. I give entire 1 GB. Click on the next. Here we find assign the drive letter. Select the last option. Do not assign a drive letter or the driver path. Select this. Click on next. Click on next. Finish. Here we find new volume is created. Now next step is minimize it. And next step is we are going to the our start and type cmd and right click on the command prompt click on run as an administrator click on run as an administrator click on yes run as an administrator is very IMP. and here i want to disable recovery environment i want to disable recovery environment so i type reagents space info i first want info and here we find Windows all info, Windows RE status is disabled. If in your case it is unable, then disable it. For this type, reagents space black slash and disable. And hit enter key. I have already disabled, so it is not disabled. It show already disabled. In your case, it show it's disabled. After that, minimize it and go to the this PC. In this PC, go to the C drive. Windows system 32 find system 32 double click on system 32 recovery go to the recovery in recovery we has to find win win re dot wim file if it's not fine then click on this three dot in a windows 11 and go to the options same for the our windows 11 or windows 10 if you not find that then go to start control panel click on the control panel in a control panel click on file explorer options same options are available on the windows 11 and windows 10 and these folder options are open now okay after that go to the view in view go to the hidden files and folder select this show hidden files folders and drivers select this check this after that go to the here here we find hide prod uh, hide protected operating system files it's hide the operating system protected files uncheck this click on yes i want click on apply click on ok and here we find pin re dot wim that means our recovery files are transferred to the this system 32 recovery folder okay that is very imp for us close it next step is go to the this command prompt one second one second go to the command prompt in a command prompt type disk part Type disk part, hit enter key. Okay. Disk part and hit enter key. Now disk part is open. Type list disk. It show all disks on the our PC or laptop. In this case, in my case, I go to the management, disk management. I have only one hard disk. If you have multiple hard disks, then it show multiple hard disks at this point. My disk number is zero. It start from the zero. First hard disk is labeled as the zero, then one, then two, then three, and goes on. Okay. I have only one hard disk, so it show disk zero. So I type, I want to select that this. I type list and disk. Select the your disk that you want. I select list zero, one number disk. Okay. 
okay okay no select i want to select not a list this type select this zero and it select zero number this after i want partition i want to see all partitions on this uh, this so i type list partition and hit enter key and we are interest interest in this partition 1024 mb partition whatever the 1024 mb partition our 1 gb newly created partition 1024 is in mb here we find primary partition and we are going to select that partition so i type select partition space and the number whatever the number of the our partition type that number i in my case phone number and hit enter key our partition is selected now i want to details of the my partition so i type detail space partition and hit enter key now it show our details of the our partition here is the our partition next step is we are going to add our id for id i give this id and attribute this is the, our id we want to set this id so select this id from the youtuber youtube description right click on it copy it or control c on your keyboard go to the cmd and control v on your keyboard and hit enter key set id then after set then space id equal sign and this number and hit enter key and dicks part successfully set the partition id next step is our gpt go to here gpt attributes whatever attributes is select that right click on it copy it go to here paste it control v on our keyboard and hit enter key okay now dix part successfully assigned to the attributes now we are going to the our dix management and it show healthy recovery partition our recovery partition is set next step is we are going to enable enable it that is very easy exit and click on the exit and re reagents type reagents and space then um, black slash and enable and enable it okay now operation is successful now we are going to reagents info and hit enter key here we find windows re status is enabled that is very imp now code here text management our operation is successful here we find healthy recovery partition is created on our pc or laptop so guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe this channel thank you guys